Tonight, the search is on for a hit and run driver who left a man for dead. Yeah, police say that driver sent a cyclist flying through midair and left right on the side of the road early this morning. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb is with us tonight. And Jason, there may be a clue to find who did it. Yeah, that's right. The Murfreesboro police say the hit and run driver was in a van that now does not have a right side view mirror. It was knocked off during the crash. Now the man who was hit is telling his story for all to hear tonight. During an ordinary evening commute along Broad Street in Murfreesboro, if you look close enough, there are signs like this bracket that something went wrong here. There's a bracket that's supposed to go here that holds the seat, and that's just, it's gone. Robert Maples says riding his bike is his escape. Fresh air, getting out and getting the exercise, and clearing my mind, you know, not fighting traffic, usually. But early this morning, Robert found that the traffic fought him. Well, all I know is, like, I was riding along, and I, I heard a boom. Police say a tan Chevy Venture van was driving down Broad Street just before 5 this morning when it left the road and hit Robert. And next thing I knew, I was, I was in the air, you know, heading towards the ground. Luckily, Robert had been wearing a helmet, and he's okay. If I hadn't been wearing it, that would have been my head. But police say the person in the tan van continued to drive off. At night, it really shows up. And that's a flashing light there, and that's a flashing light there. And the driver of the van is still on the run. There's no reason for anybody not to see me. Now, Robert has something to say to them. I just can't believe you left. I mean, accidents happen, but, I mean, I could have been lying there bleeding to death, you know? Robert and Murfreesboro police want the driver caught as Robert is looking to move on with his life following a scary crash that could have ended it. Or if he had been a couple inches over and hit me head on, I mean, it's, or tail on, you know, it's, you know, I was very, very, very blessed today. Again, Murfreesboro police say the driver was likely in a tan Chevy Venture van with a model year from 1999 to 2005. And again, that right side view mirror was knocked off during the collision this morning. If you have any information about this, call Murfreesboro police. Reporting live in the newsroom, Jason Lamb, News Channel 5. Somebody knows that.